Oh. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. Welcome to Dr. Levin's Music Lab. No, I'm not a real doctor. I lost my medical license when I accidentally sewed up the wrong person. She didn't even have a hole in her. But let's not talk about that. Let's talk about music. In this lesson, I'm going to show you a way to assemble chord progressions to make them sound futuristic and spacey. This method was taught to me by an amazing guitarist named Chris Perello, and it's good for making that Radiohead kind of sound in your music. So, for this technique, you have two types of chords and two ways of moving the chords. You have minor chords and major chords, so like C minor or C major, and from a minor chord, you can go up a minor third to its relative major and play a major chord. You can stay in place and play its parallel major chord, C minor to C major. Or you can go down a half step to a major chord, C minor to B major. For a major chord, you can go down a minor third to its relative minor. You can go stay in place and play its parallel minor, C major to C minor. And then you can go down, you can go uh, from major up a half step to minor, C major up a half step to C sharp minor. What you do is you combine these chord movements to make your progression. So you you adhere strictly to the uh, different movement types, and you can come up with chord progressions that way. For example, that's a really short snippet, and then you can make a couple short snippets and attach them together. So let's try this chord progression. We'll go D minor to C sharp major, down a half step to major, then down a minor third to minor, then to parallel major. So there's one idea. Now let's do a second idea. We'll have C sharp minor, then C major, then C sharp minor, then C sharp major. Now let's do a combination of both of those chord progressions. So now that you know the rules, and once you practice writing within the rules, then you can start breaking them a bit, bending them here and there, incorporating it into your own music, and ideally making great sounding chord progressions that you love. Um, so please don't sue me for musical malpractice. I'm really getting tired of being sued, and I hope to see you next time, but hopefully not in court. <laughs>